Hey guys, I'm Dr. JDM here. In today's video, I install racing seat into the Bluey Drift project. So to check the seat in, uh, I have to make a bracket. And my mate David, he taught me how to weld it and taught me how to design the bracket. Before we get into it, don't forget to check the website. We got a couple new drops and new stickers coming soon. So stay tuned, all right? And so let's get into it. I started by checking if a bracket will fit in the car by placing a wooden bolt under the sash seat and then took some measurements. With those measurements, David then made a cat file for the bracket. The first screen is Bruise seat rails. Including the future, we had to avoid to ensure we had a correct clearance and the seat could be mounted correctly. The second screen has red marks indicating the mounting bosses for the SAS seat. The third screen is the assembly with material selection and the creation of our adapter plates. We made sure everything created and the new seat could be safely mounted. And finally, in the last screen is the complete engineering drawings with all the measurements in accordance to what we measured in the car. Now, if you don't have access to drawing software, I would recommend to use paper and just write it down. I had David do this with me as I want to learn how to create objects in CAD. Next, we had to cut the steel with a bandsaw. We used a 2mm thick clay steel to ensure the bracket will be nice and strong. We use a bandsaw as it's very accurate and easy, however this could also be done roughly with a hacksaw. From here, we mark the whole positions as power drawings with a marker and scribe before marking it with a center punch, and then drilling through. Center punching mm -hmm. is obviously trying to get it right in the middle of our little cross, cross. here, yeah. but you can play with it. I'll show you. So yeah, what I'm going to do is get it right in the center mm -hmm. and give it a really good whack. Yep. Oh, it's pretty good. Is it okay? Yep. But you do need to correct it. Yeah. Let's say this one here. It could actually go in that direction. Okay. So you can get a drill. Yep. And push it up. Drill. Oh, okay, so make it bigger. Yeah. If, if you do decide you want to move the center a little bit. Okay. You can go a bit more. That's nine mil. Nine mil. Yep. You drill it in one, one go. Mhm. Mm because it's so thick, you really don't need any pilot hole. Yeah. Okay. If it was thin steel. Maybe you want to drill four mil. Okay. Then six mil or something. Yeah. Um, I think I'll do it like that, oh, so that if it does catch, it won't spin, on, spin on. on us. Just to keep the drill cool. Yep. 
We use a debarring tool to take the sharp edge off the holes. This is better than using a normal drill bit. Make sure to test fit the everything mates up correctly against the bracket. We use MA bolts for this. Just roughly today. Yeah. Alright. Straight in. We, we'll make that second mark. Yep. On those measurements mm -hmm. before we bolt it in. And then once we've bolted in, we can measure it and see how close we are and adjust it if we have to. Yeah. We then mark the south sea holes and follow the same process as before. With this dimension, yep. it's a bit precise, but this is the dimension we're trying to achieve when it's bolted into the car. I think so. Weld uh, whichever end screws onto here. Mm -hmm. Now they're just packers, so the weld isn't doing any strength work, so yep. we don't have to worry about that. But yep. what we don't want it to do is slip around and yeah. so on. Yep. There's a feature under the main or the original weld. seat where we need to clear, so mm -hmm. that's going to lift it up. Yeah, so make sure it's. Yeah. Now, in order to weld the two parts together, we must cut the bevel on the two parts. This will improve the strength of the weld. This can be achieved by many different tools, so it's up to your preference and what you have available. So we're gonna just bevel that, those edges. Yep. The way I do that, so this is just so we don't bevel the wrong yep. thing, that's all. So I like to put those two pieces together. Mm -hmm. In order to cut your bevels, place the two pieces of steel together and mark both sides with a marker along the edge where you're going to be welding. This will be your guide for where to cut. I'll do that, that side. Once you've cut your bevels, use a hammer to level the two pieces. We are using gasless MIGI weld. We're gonna be welding where we bevel. But first, we tack weld to put the pieces together and then fill in the rest after. Oh, don't forget to wear welding gear if you weld.
Now, we jump quickly back in the car to make sure the measurement for the south sea is correct before we drill the holes. Alright, David. What are we doing today? So today is the big day. Mm -hmm. We're gonna now that's all welded. Yep. We're going to drill these out. Okay. And deburr. Mm -hmm. And then put in the car. What do we got there? A deburring tool. Deburring tool. And a countersink tool. I'll measure on the hundred. Mm -hmm. Four, 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 five. Four, four, five. Which is three, four, five. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, we measure in the car before and it was 345 or in 344 so look at that big day we're going to big day put the seat holes in the seat holes yeah the... which will be exciting we're going to go 20 up from the bottom and then 275 to that was meant to use this plate but oops what we'll have to do i think later is cut that off possibly take it home and use that bandsaw yeah yeah to cut it and mm -hmm. get it off yeah is it because if you think about it the bolt is gonna oh yeah that's not good no. yeah, so. that's all right yep easy to fix mm -hmm. i think we'll do bolt this to the seat first yeah. and then bolt this to the rails. Yeah, right. sounds good. All done? All done. I don't know if I can get that in here. You got it? A few minutes later. What do you reckon? I feel, feel tall. I was going to say, do you feel height-wise? Yeah, height-wise perfect, I think. A little racing seat, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that, that's as far back as it goes. Yeah. But it's not, not too tall from there either. Maybe with a helmet. I could go sideways in this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very good. All right. Good stuff. Now that we are happy that everything's going to work, we grind the well down to make a smoother surface using an angle grinder. I think we can grind those lush yep if you want to mm -hmm. it's a lot more work than just leaving it yeah but i think it's, it's it's probably a good exercise for yep. you yeah absolutely so i'm, I'm gonna go now with the flat disc mm -hmm. and i'm gonna take it down flush yep
that width, if you like, yep. however wide I go, that's going to determine how big my radius is going to be. If I went deeper, the radius would be bigger in the end. So. See, you've got down a, a chamfer all the way around. Normally, I would do these first. But, yeah. And then, last and least, we can give it a sand and sandblast. Mm. says signal red. To finish off, we decided to give a powder coat to make it look nicer, but spray painting would have also worked. Yeah. I love it. That finished, you know, when we do all that. Uh, yep. You don't get to see that till right till the end. True. You know. Oof. Cool. And finally, installing the driver's seat. Oh, yeah. mm. Good contract. Oh, love it. Oh yeah, perfect. What do you think? Oh yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. Like just, yeah. Oh, it's a hot high. It's high for me. It is. <laughs> How's your... How's that? I love it. Yeah, pretty cool. Feels straight. Very That's straight. Look at that. It's just fitting perfectly. Wow. That is cool. Well, we're going to go for a quick drive. Quintessential backseat driver. <laughs> Trying to explain this to the policeman. <laughs> like, oh, well. Well. We're just going to go U turn there. Okay. They had a turbo in this. <laughs> How do you feel with that? Um, yeah. I'm having good fun. I'm gonna show feel for sure. I'll bring my car back in. So now I have to buy a bosket and yes, new stand wheels and new tires. It will be so much better. New wheels. New